decriminalization. <laughs> and that's what I tell you. No, no, go so. No, no, go so. Nobody, na, they not decriminalize nothing. Because, yeah. look here, you see, when, when a thing is not criminal, yeah. a man can't get caught with it. Full right. stop. Yeah. And you can still get caught with ganja under this new system. And if you don't conform to, to the interventions yes. introduced by the police, yes. then you will see if it's not criminal act. Well, let me say, if you don't pay the ticket, of course, they may lock you up. <laughs> they may not keep it a lock, man. <laughs> so, what I know? What I know? Is who? What I know? Yes. So, isn't it beneficial to. Because it's a group celebrating, you know. It's enough man to celebrate. So, isn't it. Isn't it a, 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 a stress remove when we know, say, the police can't just rush you for one spliff? And I tell you, I tell you, so then can, can still, still rush you to one split. <laughs> it's just that the language change. change. And the only thing we change, you know. True. The Words. language say, all right. Is what that you have there, Rasta man? Yes. Well, Our little, little black man. What, yeah. what that you have there? It's a little vegetable matter, officer. <laughs> all right. I'm going to write you up. Okay. Your name John Brown. Yeah. Where ID there? Officer, I know I'm not ID. I'm going to lock you up. He can lock you up same, same way, you know, way because you can't prove who you is. And him the done did want to lock you up because you see in a fee mind and based on the system, colloquial system of bad mind around this country. Mm. You think it's one or two policemen now go feel it for no say him cannot oppress as much as, as he much was oppressing as... before. That's what I'm trying to get at now. Is 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 that supposed to be the, the break that the oppression is a little bit? Well, what you're going to find, you know, yeah. you have some serious money in this country, you know. You get a two ounce franchise. Yeah. But a real two ounce franchise, yeah. you want. You want a two pound franchise. All right. That means you can't catch him with two ounces. He just don't work with that. True. It's two pounds he walk with. And, and guys, a man that come bearing ganja gifts, and he might also be a merchant of the said same subject. So. Remember this, my brother. You see, in the middle of all the way they must say, yeah. and the whole heap of lie they must tell about the ganja business, <laughs> yeah. you don't hear them must say about the legal cultivation of ganja to supply the demand of two owns per user. No legalization of cultivation not going on. In other words, on. no. The farming of ganja is not legal yet. But look here, them no have no intention. No intention of making the farming it. legal. So how how is it them going to promote the pharmaceutical ganja unless when I man farmers them, are allowed to grow it? When I man say them do have an intention yeah. to legalize it, I, I man speaking generally. Yeah. You see when them talking about pharmaceutical right, ganja, right. yeah. Is a different, a whole different ball game. That is government. Is government are going at the business now, you know, is government are giving out the franchise All right. to whoever will be allowed to grow, to grow pharmaceutical ganja. In the same way that Rasta, based on women here, they must say, will be allowed to grow sacrament ganja. Hmm. Is the same way you're going to have another set of people who are able to do that. But you see, based on the international conventions and and, 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 and different treaties that Jamaica have had to be signature to. Yeah. No. The freeing up of ganja on a wider basis is not about to happen. The revenue stream of the government has been enhanced by what go on right now, what's going on right now. So, I wonder if is there a victory for us in this or is a trick? Warning. The Sergeant General warns. Cigarette smoking is dangerous. Dangerous. Hazard to your health. Does that mean anything to you? Legalize marijuana. Right here in Jamaica. Yeah. Them say 
Peter uh, Award, governmental award, and him get some of the most brutal treatment for the same thing that the government said them freeing up now. Well, they, I said them say, yes, so them say, them are free it up. Mm -hmm. But I tell the man that is really an economic decision mm -hmm. made by them. For you see, at the end of the day them still have the authority to send a man to jail or prison for the use of ganja. True. Even though them said them decriminalize him. In other words, no, if the man refused to pay the fine and refused to do the community service, they must lock him up. Same way. Him, right. him, him going to go to prison because yeah. you will find that there is a process that ends up in her majesty's, majesty's courthouse. courthouse. Same way. And you get sentenced in her majesty's courthouse. Yeah to do time in, in her, her majesty's, majesty's prison. prison that's where they put e exactly yeah. so so you right through the time you know you're going to find rasta because remember says rasta them attacking you know concerning ganja mm -hmm. so you will find that rasta still going to prison for ganja because remember you know we know about go prison for ganja True. a long time rasta man i go prison for ganja True. Them can come come tell we know so them free ganja. Rasta done did free that long time. And Rasta not only free it, but Rasta propagated a doctrine of ganja that has taken hold right throughout the length and breadth of the diaspora. Rasta don't need no favor from Babylon government concerning grass concerning ganja. Them can do. What them want to do, Rasta will continue to do what we want to do concerning ganja. That is not to say, you know, my brother, that I and I don't have a certain level of appreciation in terms of being very understanding that they would want to do what they're doing concerning ganja. Hmm. But no favor to Rasta. And you know, say, when you look at it, you know, it is not a liberation for Rastafari, you know. I see a lot of Rasta bridge in them, almost like them celebrating this, this, this set of announcements by the government. But if we look at it from a historical perspective, the plant was always what it is. It has not changed. It did free. Free, we free. Always a free plant, and we always know a set of powers and medicinal values. Yes. So if that hasn't changed, why has the government changed? And their attitude towards the thing, something going on. And, and I man tell you, it's the it's, money. It's a, it's a money move. It's the money. It's not no it's nothing more about health. Nothing about the benefit of the people. Nothing about medicine. Nothing about the empathizing for the sick. Because in a truth, no, in a Once they establish these medicinal things, you know, we good. I can't afford it, you know. 